Hey guys, Takara here, welcome back to my channel. We are now on episode 5 of season 6 of Supernatural. Let's get straight into it. Bit of a rocker bar. Emily Fang. Yeah, because that looks like her. <laughs> Emily is going to be trouble, isn't he? Damn it. This is some Twilight-esque shit, this isn't it? See, that's one thing I've never done. It's like, if you cut your finger, I never instantly put it in my mouth. Wait. Stefan Salvatore just did a runner. Oh, he's back. Or is he more of a demon? I doubt it, because he went away. Damon would have just Hi. out of alive. I have to show you something. I knew it. Are you scared? No. You should be. This is... Bit cringy to watch. I can never hurt you. I mean, you could. You could literally eat your life, snap in half. Let me show you my world. This girl, sucker for punishment. Nice work, Robbie. Robert, what's happening? This is what you wanted, isn't it? What a fool. Just shut up and get your ass home. I can't wait to see you. This phone thing's getting old. Yeah. Oh, look at his little smile at the thought of her wanting to see him. So she had an obsession with vampires. All right. But that's just uncomfortable. She didn't have a password protection on her laptop. It's good by error. Oh. <laughs> Never mind. Are they taking the piss out of Twilight? Oh, is Twilight not even out then? Lautner. How do you even know who that is? Are you kidding me? That kid's everywhere. It's a freaking nightmare. So it was out then. Hey, how many T's are there in patents? That's it. We're in. So it's patents in. <laughs> well, her inbox is full from some guy claiming to be a vampire. A real vampire? Okay, so now you're sure it's vampires. 100%. Definitely. We got a pattern now. Find the nest. Find the nest. Figure it out. You're pretty. Yeah, sorry again, pal. I don't play for your team. Wow. <laughs> Why is he stop running? What's he doing? Why is Sam hesitating? What is Sam doing? Sam? What is he doing? Oh, no. This isn't good, is it? Well, shit. He's ingested it, hasn't he? Can this be undone? I cannot believe Sam just did that. Took all the ways to die. I never thought I'd be going out like this. Dean, nobody is going out. Samuel's gonna kill me when he gets here. No, Dean, he's not. Yes, he is, because I'm gonna ask him to, because you won't do it. Okay, just hold on a second. For what? Huh? Look at me! We can figure this out. How? This is Sam's fault. Why aren't you freaked out? Of course I am. I can hear your heart beating. It's pretty damn steady. I'm trying to remain calm. Dean, look, Samuel will know what to do. Oh, shit. And so it begins. No. No, no, no. Dean. Oh, this is not going to be good. Don't you hurt her. I gotta go. No, not Ben. No, Ben. Ben just stay there. I said stay back! I want to say goodbye to Lisa, which for the record is a lousy idea. Dean, answer the question. No, I'm not fed yet. You can relax. I didn't drink anyone. I didn't drive all this way to kill you, Dean. I'm here to save you. Oh, okay. Okay, okay. How, though? There's a cure. Hey, the cure is good. But a lot of this is on you. You drink, you're done. Trickiest thing on the list. Blood of the fang who turned you. I think I was huge. There's nothing in the recipe about easy. I can get it. You gonna walk right into the nest? Well, I'm one of them, aren't I? I should come with you. No. Dude, you yeah, you've done enough, Sam. You're like a walking hamburger. He looks worried. What the hell's wrong with you, Sam? What do you mean? You knew about the cure. No, I didn't. No, we talked about it months ago. 
It must have been Christian or something. That's strange, because if you had known, it'd be almost like you let him get turned. Get him in on the inside? Help us find that alpha vamp we've been looking for? That's why he did it. You serious? Well, yeah. You think I'd do something like that? Like you body? did. You hesitated. I'm just relieved we can fix him. Hmm. Curious. Please, yeah. with me, boy. This isn't gonna go well, is it? Dean, you okay? Yeah, I'm good. So you managed it. We got the syringe. Jeez. Okay, so what'd you see in there? <laughs> what? In the nest. What'd you see? Say, I can't hear you. you. Your blood is so freaking loud, okay? Just, just back off. Right, give me the damn Oh, that looked chunky as anything. See, Sam was pushing and to see what was inside the nest. Samuel was right, wasn't he? Whoa. So does he, is he seeing that now? Did he see Sam's, like, expression then? He did, he saw it, didn't he? He did. He knows to be worried now, right? He needs to trust his gut. How'd it go with Lisa? Well, didn't. not great. I'm sorry. Yeah. Are you, though? At least, uh, you got my back. No matter what happens, I can always count on you, right, Sammy? Mm. Yeah, of course, Dane. Liar! Such a day, liar. Interesting. With this episode, the main thing that I took from it was the fact that Sam literally put Dean's life at risk there to get intel. Samuel was definitely right when he said that if Sam would have let Dean become this vampire, he could have got into the nest, found out information, because he knew that there was a cure. Whereas old Sam would never have put Dean's life at risk like that because there was no guarantee that the cure would work or if they could even get the cure. And the smirk, like the half smile that he did, oh gosh, it really caught me off guard. But I'm, I'm loving that sort of plot twist and the development that they're going to go down there. I really like that idea because I do think that Jared plays bad very well and I don't know, it just excites me. Although obviously I want Dean and Sam to be the best of friends and just loyalty being strong and all that, but from like a, an interest and excitement point of view, I do really like it, I must say. Samuel is, his sort of loyalty is sort of growing on me now a little bit because he did pull Sam up on that, which I think is good. And he did get the cure for Dean and handed over his granddad's journal. It's a big step, isn't it? But yeah, not 100% yet on Samuel, but I definitely think that there's growth there. Sam's growth has gone down, and Dean, I just feel for because he doesn't really have anyone now because he's risked things with Lisa following that. He threw Ben against that wall. Obviously, he couldn't help it, but that's what happened. All thanks to Sam, so. Nice one, Sam. <laughs> I hope everyone enjoyed this reaction. If you did, give it a cheeky thumbs up and subscribe you know, if you want to, but there's no pressure here. And I hope to see you all again soon for another video. Thanks for watching, guys. Bye.